Darren Spider, gamer, playing Northgard. I haven't actually played this game in a little while. Let me move my mic around a little bit. So there may be a little bit of a weird thing. I got a, I got a special guest with me to enjoy this Northgard game because, you know, go introduce yourself. <laughs> It's John Cena! No, it's not. It's your boy Zappa, two time cosplay champ. Feel the power! It's a new game. Yes, it is. Well, it's not robots, I'll tell you that right now. That's fine. <laughs> I, so, I can play a not robot game. Is it farming? It's technically a. It's technically Civilization, CNC, and um, Vikings all at the same time. Vikings are good. Yes. I like Norse uh, mythology. I will tell you, uh, the little amounts of months I've actually played in this game was um, your villagers get unhappy with you every winter. And unhappiness leads to... Oh, what the heck happened? What? No. Ah. Save the computer? Oh, okay, I, that's fine. Ah, no, we're yeah. fine. We're fine. <laughs> so, we're gonna, we can do a multiplayer game, which is actually something you can come up to later. Um, oh, yeah. Or you can do campaign, or you can just do a single player. Um, we're gonna check my options real quick. Hopefully, I killed it. I killed it. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> so I make sure everything is kind of. Yeah, no, that's so we'll, we'll, we'll do that on. on All right, yeah. Well, we're gonna just. Hostility, medium. We're gonna stay with medium. Uh huh. We got to do campaign. Campaign's also kind of fun. Hey, this is your game. Let's see. I am Rig, son of the High King Hargurorf, and this Ooh, is my, my saga. saga. <laughs> it all began one fateful day. It's always one fateful day, it's never two. My father had gathered all his yards. To make an announcement of the utmost importance. See, when I first started playing this, none of this existed. We were to embark for the wondrous no. lands of Northgard. The campaign didn't exist. It was just conquest and glory awaited us on this mysterious new continent. But the Norns had other plans for us. Dozens of so armed men suddenly poured oh, into the, the hall the, the and put an yeah, abrupt the end not to our ambitions I I this game. and only to player. our lives. Oh, I hope this isn't trying to rip off the banner saga. They were mercenaries, led oh, by a man sure, named Hagen from the clan of the Raven. It's video game. Yep. In a matter of minutes, yeah, based on we your were clan, all slaughtered uh, like sheep. What clan you choose? It gives you oh, certain abilities. Uh, but me, like if a clan wolf, every time you kill an animal, uh, you get food for your. I had no way to fight back, so you I know the clan does that. death, which I find hilarious. Mm. I see that as he stole the map of Northgard and, then, uh, and ripped the regal horn like, from my father's throne, really a family really heirloom, cool, like, and the very yeah, symbol of our stuff. royalty. Which I had gets to, to call down the power of the gods to smite their and reclaim Good. Their kinghood. None of them. No, uh, no, nobody's uh, broke, and the Norse gods have abandoned all mankind. It is past probably. Ragnarok. All right, so that's we're loading a thing. Loading, loading. Oh, that's Excellent. not loading. That's a dwarf. We have see if they escape the remote region. It's all remote at this point in day and age. Clan sta stag clan. Aw, for stag clan. I have Was it like no randomly chosen? I have a feeling that the, the again campaign oh, yeah. they're stag gonna clan start you off with the by with a the proud young stag clan's not bad. It's just not your favorite. It's not my favorite. Harkin's I like clan wolf. Had set his town uh, even in mech warrior stuff and uh, battle to uh, mech warrior stuff. Not even his father, clan wolf the clan's yarl, who had died at the hands of the fiend, just like mine. Uh, Our common enemy had sailed for Northgard, Plus over which he now had a map. But hey, All I could games. think about was finding him too. to avenge my father and retrieve sure. the regal horn. This, this is your game. Well, now there's no point in skipping. Oh. Took it away. Oh. Skipping. 
See, and every time you uh, do a different clan, that that loading screen that it changes out to. Well, it better be. So, here's my peoples. Back of the scene, actually, it's present. You cover, I guess. So. so, basically, you can turn these people into just about anything you want, um, as long as you have the building to do so. And the more you discover, you have to have a scout to discover stuff, and then you can basically go in and buy land through food or, or money, depending on which clan you are. Usually, it's food. You should buy land. Don't play those spinning rooms. Safe food area, those with basic survival food, but in housing, trans guys are totally mm -hmm. So they're giving me one warrior, which is a different. You know, the house I can build, a scouting camp, which will open up this area, and you can only have so many houses per plot. Alright, so, so how do we get out of the void? We need to explore the void. Yeah, we need to explore the void, but I mean, we do a lot of what we do. So this is an RTS. Yeah. Okay. I can do multiple buildings at once. So yeah. So long as you have people that ain't doing shit. If they're if if you if they're just kind of roaming around, they're just uh, this this girl is just forging for food. Okay. And just very slow. She'll just uh, do do her own thing on yeah. her own. And the warrior will walk around basically and just defend wherever. Uh, oh, you yeah. can't defend. You, you're gonna be a wood, wood cutter. And once you like go to the building, she'll just automatically start look exploring. Uh huh. We just gotta go. So she, she just wanders off into the void rather than Pretty much, like yeah. She'll see, see the progressively yeah. opening the. I can have two. Oh okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, the hap as long as they, as long as my uh, villagers, villagers are happy, they will produce villagers. Once they become unhappy, they stop producing villagers. Ah! We've recovered the world. We're recovering. And I can direct her to do to certain places. Oh, okay. Too, so it it looks like she's just running run the, run the border of what you can. So you, I'm going to make you a woodcutter because wood's going to be kind of important because when winter comes, you burn twice, as, twice as much wood and you eat three times as much food. Because it's freaking cold! So right now I have eight villagers and nine, and I'm having nine consumptions. So I need to I need to find a farmland. It says fertile land, which I can actually go and say I'm colonize it for twenty food. Uh, well, I'm going to colonize it because I need that. Convert. Oh yeah, this is the other thing. I had to build houses. Well, you you need more resource to build house. One step at a time. There is one building that I think is really cool that you don't need that doesn't go into that building quota. Oh, That is a defensive structure. Oh, yeah. Okay. But I won't get that until... Until you have more people. Uh, until I basically have... Um, basically, I'll put one of those down, but... It's also the other way of dealing with it. It's like a woodcutter and two uh -huh. villages. Uh -huh. So. Get yeah. over there. Get over there, woman. We need your hard labor. Yeah. I'm seeing some number next to your civilians. Is that the number of that civilian? Yep. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, this is tells me I have two woodcutters. Mm -hmm. I have two villagers and one scout. Okay. Uh, I've upped my, um, my my houses, and this tells me how many uh, villagers I can have at any given or any given time, and how many people I can have in my village. Yeah. This tells me how many people I have in my war band. I can only have one in my war band because I started off with him. Yeah. Um, until I basically build a military base. So this is gonna be really good. That's for would, but this wolf right here will attack him. Alright, so go 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 ruin his day. She's gonna be a fun. That will greatly produce uh, food. Okay. 
good. So, what, what I think your woodsman that is about to turn into some wood needs to might start cutting into over into this this wooded void over here. Um, or can you just freely walk through there? Or is that that yellow line of uh, an actual barrier? Oh, what's going on? What happened? He's real the forsaken cottage. Salvage resources. Ooh. Forsaken or abandoned? That's two different things. Abandoned. Because forsaken means that that shit is religiously off limits. You don't you want to touch that. There are cursed objects. <laughs> yes. Re yeah, we're about to get into that. Oh. Uh, oh. There are cursed objects. Oh. Ho, 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 ho. Um, Adventure. See, I got a phone on this guy. She's right there. Hey. So she discovers chunks at a time, and each chunk has a thing. I have to colonize it, that's fine. Yeah. It takes time for her to uh, discover stuff. She she can defend herself a little bit. Like, the wolves won't bother her too much. But I have to take them out to take over that the area. Because uh, I can't take over occupied area. This is not NXT. No yeah. takeover. No takeover. He's doing that. We got that. We have our warrior chick here. Okay, so the, the that the yellow line up here on the left, that's not a you cannot pass. That's a you ain't got that yeah. that's you don't own it. Yeah, I don't own it. I can I can own it by colonizing it. Okay, but can you walk through all those trees? That's, yes. Okay. Oh, yeah. The trees do not impede you from no. going. Okay. No, in fact this tree actually is good for uh, when you see the big trees like this. They'll actually up your uh, your wood value for that yeah. for that plot. Each plot of hex land actually has its own little characteristics. Like this is be good for hunting because of all the deer. Yeah. Um, and this is actually really good for, for forestry and stuff like that. And then right. these little things are good for mining. Uh, but yeah, I needed the food more than I needed. The oh yeah, no, totally. But, of course. I just you know I'm 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 the newbie here. Yeah, yeah. So now that we've got that up. See, this is the uh, kind of RTS I could handle because it's not sitting there waiting on, you know, the other army in the void. Yeah. No. You know, it's like, oh, look, Zerg Rush, key, key, key. I'm still learning how to play this game. Nope, nope, time for Zerg. Yeah, no, it, it takes a little bit of time to, to kind of learn it. I hate house placement. You didn't rotate it. I tried. Oh. As long as you tried. I tried. And you can upgrade everything. It's like, I have to upgrade the town hall. Yeah, um, the long house. But I need stone for that. And I can go out and basically create other stuff, but right now I'm just going to figure it out. You got to lay down your bases. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, that was super close to the mic. Just, oh, just to lean in to see the screen. Yeah, okay. And I can only have so many warband people based on how many of these types of things I have built. Um, I can improve my. Something on this here. Um, there's a beach. Don't you have a beach? Yeah, but it tells you it doesn't have like a beach beach. Uh, yeah, these, these are little river outfits, basically. Okay, it's not the real. Yeah. Food silos actually prevent. Um, Loss of food during famine and infestation and attack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's, it's yeah. storing your foods. Yeah. Something's happening. Winter will be coming. Uh, we'll be here soon. Winter is coming! Ah, God, no! no. <laughs> your military troop. Singular. Please. Yeah. No, I got two. I got two now. Oh, there's two. Okay. Yeah, I, I got one warrior here and one warrior here. Your mini map shows a skull. What what is what is what is this trouble? The trouble That is, is the enemy. Oh damn it. That is a wolf bit. Oh, okay. Well, that's that's fine. The wolves aren't sitting there, you know, they're only pile stockpiling now, we're not stockpiling skill. Well, it even tells you like meat, wood, treasure, treasure, death. Right. <laughs> death. So why can you not collect the treasure yet again? I have to own it. Oh. So which means you have to go and... Like, colonize and then use your scout to explore the house. Crowns so, and food. Why are we not colonizing? 
Does it cost 40 at the moment? Oh, okay. Right. You, you, have, you have number. I do, but this is going to go away real soon. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, nice. There's another thing Ah, well, See? game over. You, it's winter, everything so. froze over. You lose. I think you might want to pull your scout back, because they are like... Yeah, he's she's fine. <laughs> okay. As long as they're fine. Do the farms still work during the winter? Yes. It's, do they just slow down? Or? It just slows down. And it's like, yeah, 14 villagers, 3 farmer, uh, pl plus 3 from the farming, 17 consumption. So, I'm burning... One food every tick, and I'm growing. Oh. So, have more yeah. farmer? Yeah, that's kind of probably good idea, I mean, not even more farms, but farmer. Oh. Probably. I'm sure you might have to work a little harder. Alright, now it's going to be Aha! What? Find a suitable coast for the construction of a Okay. A real beach. Not a beach. Uh, here's the here's the rub. I have to connect it. Oh yeah. Which means I have to go through the wolf then. Right. Well, yeah, of course. It's, it's right. that is tutorial stage. It's like, okay, here's your goal. Now fight your way there. Uh -huh. All right. So I'm gonna do this a little bit more. Build another. I have to take that over. Okay. Fine. Minimize it. Send our war oh. guy over here. Send the warrior. Other ways of making food and stuff like that. Just, just farms are actually easier. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I'm sure you, you could get some some meat resource off of them wolves. Uh, not with this clan actually. What, remember what I was saying about about the uh, the clan wolf? You take out a wolf, it gives you it gives you food. Uh, you take out a monster, it gives you food. Um, and yes, there are monsters here. Uh, so the uh, gods are not gone. Just no, no, they're, they're just they're just very unhappy. With I don't know why, but these wolves, if it's, I'm really surprised they haven't actually attacked it yet. Oh look, it's green. Yay. Rebuild a law and build a long ship dock. All right. I need more men. <laughs> Money to and resources to make orders, but they're actually being pretty lenient since it's the first technically yeah. campaign. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, because it starts you with nothing, and I guess in further stages you'll at least start with something. So, we're gonna just go. <laughs> I'm doing this without a healer too. I can. I, I should. Be, I should have built a uh, healer. Pot. I, mean, I didn't see any kind of pop up as far as the. Uh... 
as far as that, that exploring that hut went. So we can colonize that for 80. Or just stand right there. Uh, and then this guy right here. I should put him uh, Heels. Uh, so what became of, of your exploring the condemned? Uh, the Forsaken. The Forsaken, there should be a... It's, it's the scout. It just... It's already done. Yeah. Well, what did you get? Like, there was no pop. I was like, oh, you got numbers. Well, that's lame. I just didn't see it. I looked down. It's fine. I was about to say, like, what, what, what will happen? It's fine. This is why they're okay. Yeah. Well, now you have colonized the the wolf den. Destroy it? No, it's, it's done. Destroy the core. Find number with our job. I'd make one healer. Right. And he starts healing. Anyone that's injured or sick. Okay, well. Right. Include them, because you're right. they, we should reel them back in that way it's not so. Oh, the, the scout was hurt! That actually is. Ahoy! Ahoy! just said the scout was hurt while it's like, ah, she slipped on a rock. No, she, she, found, she found wolves. I'm not gonna take care of that. Oh. <laughs> Go get them, men Solve and women. The problem. <laughs> That looks like a fucking place land, that's what that is. I see a thing. Unstable swamp. Alright, so we're gonna go to the swamp. That's getting too close to my food. <laughs> Colonize this a hundred every time. Uh, every time you colonize something, it ups your, your ne uh, it ups the next time you colonize something. So it's like 120. To, when you start out with 40, yeah, yeah it but, sucks. But you know the next objective is to get over there and, and build boat. Yeah. Should increase far. I can't do it. But you don't hear lightning. You see lightning. You hear thunder. See the like, no, no little thing here that I could try to colonize, but I gotta colonize this. Yeah, and that. And I just don't really care right now. And I could repurpose this too because um, I can just sit around and make a new job if I'm yeah, done scouting like, out. It's like no, no more, no more scouting than happens. Yeah, when I colonized it, you see the wolf den is no longer there. Oh yeah, it looks a little smushed. Oh, yeah. Port begins. Yes, the work begins. Hmm. Hall. Uh, Hall of Skulls. I'm gonna turn our scout oh, into a this Oh my goddess. The one You're gonna build it. Oh yeah, because you built boats upside down back in that. No, it's actually the, uh, it's an up upturned boat that creates more boats. It's That's how they do it. That's not how you make boats. <laughs> boats don't spawn baby boats. That's not asexual reproduction. I know. 
again, these are Vikings. It's no, no it's it, it, it's a representation. It's I a representation. Yeah, no, I totally get it. Now, what I love about this is basically this is a glorified pirate here. She's about to be a pirate queen. Because I'm gonna send her off as a as a sailor, and they go off to either um, fame cutscene. or runes. Now we leave here. Ready to sail from Northgar. Mm. Destroy me. And we're done. That's it. That's it. You, you did go go build a deck. Yep. So it if gives you, you don't if explore everything, it's just can't chalk it up as a loss. Yep. And I'm assuming that actually is the real game, and this is the this tutorial zone. Tutorial zone. Yeah, you only got a silver medal on that shit. I know. Because Replay I... for completion. Now. Yep. <laughs> uh, I will definitely <laughs> do that, actually. Uh, with these types of games, it actually is a lot of fun for me to do completion dev games. Yeah, so, some, sometimes sometimes it's worth it. Sometimes it's Dynasty Warriors, and that's way too yeah. much for completion. I'll do it. Yeah. Not everyone will. Well, I think this will be in it for right now. Um, thanks for joining me. Ah! <laughs> in, in this great adventure of Northgar and Vikings. <laughs> hey, I like Vikings. It's a good time. Like, all right. You take care, Sigzion. Sigzion.